Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth and in today's video it is a first impression slash demo on this hair mask right here which is by Curl Junkie and this is the Hibiscus and Banana Deep Fix. Now this is day two hair so let me take it back to when I apply this product all throughout my hair so we could talk about the claims. So let's start with what this product is all about on this very gloomy day. So in the back it says right here, it doesn't really say much on the bottle. I can read you the directions. So the direction says massage onto wet hair for at least five minutes, comb with a white tooth comb or fingers, then rinse, can be used with or without a plastic cap. I'm gonna have to read directly what the website states because on this jar, it doesn't give me much information. So let's go to the website. This conditioner can be used daily, weekly as an instant hydration conditioner, deep conditioner, or as a leave-in. It provides penetrating moisture to all hair types without being too heavy. This honey rich conditioner detangles the hair and helps hair clump together to form better curls. What is Work. what is what is bleaching? You ain't got no battery. If I had a dollar for every time I said that my battery is dying, I would have a lot of dollars. So this does have a protective seal. And this is what the texture looks like. It is on the, like the clumpier side, but this is just the texture straight from the jar. I smell banana. Yes, yeah, this product does smell like bananas, but this is how the product looks all throughout my hands. It is not on the thin side, but it's not too thick. This smells like, you know what? It smells like bubble gum. Smell this, Anthony? This is straight up bubble gum. Whoa. It does smell like, like pink bubble gum. Pink like bubble, bubble gum. gum, wow. So this is the product. At first, I smelled a little bit of banana, but this is straight up bubble gum. I'm happy when a product has slip. Why does it smell like bubble gum? Like it says banana and hibiscus. It does not smell like banana or hibiscus. It smell bubble like gum. banana. I did in the beginning, but nope. Does it have banana in it? Like is it's that like hibiscus like a... plantains? Wow, mm -hmm. plantains are nice. Plantago species plantain. Blossom. Interesting. That's cool. It really has it. It has an orange peel wax, whatever that is. <laughs> Do you like it? Very smell? You know me. I don't really care too much for like super sweet scent. But this one, I mean it is on the sweet side. This is straight up bubble gum. But is it like that bubble yum? Like the very big pink um, tape? Yeah. I'm smelling that. If you like that scent, then you're not going to have no problem with this. I just want to see after I rinse it out if it's going to linger on the hair. Because the Sultanicals, Ayurvedic, is like the glide in something it's like brown that one when i rinse my hair out i can smell that on my hair for days so that's like the only hair mask that i had that ever was super strong on my hair but i don't know i feel like this is not gonna really linger and if it does i think it's gonna smell nice i'm gonna i'm gonna touch up i'm like i got it on my shirt my shirt is dripping i got product all over me mm. i'm gonna take care of it more in the bathroom but let me finish with this last part so this is all that I'm going to apply to my hair right now on camera. I'm definitely gonna retouch in the bathroom, fix my part a little bit better. It was easy to glide in, very strong scent. So I'm gonna go ahead, let it sit in my hair for about 30 minutes, and then I'll come back when my hair is completely air dried. I was gonna say air washed. When it's completely air dried to give you guys my first impression. So I'll be right back. I definitely fixed my hair in the bathroom, made the part a little bit better, combed out all the conditioner that was stuck in my hair because that looked it looked a hot mess while I went to edit quickly and just wanted to show you guys how my hair is looking. I'm still air drying. It's been about 10 minutes of having the conditioner in my hair. And I don't know. Definitely got to change my shirt. But I'm going to let it sit for much longer than 10 minutes, like 30, maybe even 40 minutes. And then I'll just come back to show you guys how it rinse out and to give you my first impression. So I'll be right back. Peace out. So you know how I said I was going to leave this in my hair for about 20 to 30 minutes? I left it on for like an hour and a half and it felt so soft rinsing it out like the water which is gliding through my hair which i loved so much so very easy to apply to the hair and also easy to rinse out and outside of the shower it was the same thing my hands were just gliding through my hair so it did not feel dry and it felt very soft
So now let's talk about the ingredients. So with this product, I'm not seeing any silicone in it. And this is what the ingredient list looks like. It has that aloe vera leaf, it got shea butter, hibiscus. So a lot of good things are in this. And this product is available on the website for $20. Not only did I use this conditioner as a deep conditioner, I use it as a rinse out so in the shower while my hair was soaking wet I did apply it my hair felt so soft it has so much slip so using it as a rinse out or as a deep conditioner I found that my hair felt equally soft so I did enjoy using this hair mask and overall with the claims of it it mentioned that it's gonna help hydrate the hair and help revitalize it I don't really know about revitalizing my hair but being hydrating and moisturizing I do think that is true because my hair did not feel dry when I did use it so I did enjoy that what's funny about this product is that it mentions that the scent is like a tropical banana and I do not get that at all like I keep mentioning it all throughout this video this has a bubblegum scent like so it smells like candy to me i'm not mad about it only because it doesn't really linger on the hair so i'm not mad about it but if you do not like strong sweet scents i would be careful with this but this is nothing i don't think it's too strong anthony you think it's too strong no now if you're watching the video to this point you should definitely leave me i was gonna say a bubblegum emoji but then i checked and there is no such thing as a bubblegum emoji that i could find so we're gonna move on to the next thing which is gonna be leave me a candy emoji I'll show you guys what it looks like up top that way you can use it and I can know you're watching the video to this point but that's pretty much all I want to talk about in this short and to the point review I really just wanted to focus on the ingredient list how this product applies to the hair and rinses out the sense of it because I think that is very important to me so if you guys are interested in this product I hope you find this review very helpful and let me know down below what are some hair masks that you are currently using please share that and I don't know if you guys have anything else you would like to know about this product definitely leave a comment down below let's chat and I will see you guys in the next video bye guys